Hi there, I'm Mr. Sunshine back again for my unique take on the subjects you've been sending in at B985.fm. Thanks for sending in some great topics. And uh, let's pick out our latest topic today. Oh, well, it's spring here and uh, maybe your lawn's ready for mowing. Gardening and landscaping. Well, you know, I like gardens. I love it when people uh, that I know have gardens give me stuff from it. But I, I really don't have a green thumb. You know, I, I don't think uh, I have the patience for gardening. You, you put the seed in and, okay, where the heck's my cukes? But uh, no. So gardening, fine for other people. Fine for them to give uh, stuff from their garden to me. But, uh, you know, the produce aisle at Hannaford's good enough for this guy. But uh, lawn, lawn, lawn care, landscaping, for me, I, I basically just mow my lawn. And it can be an adventure. I live in a mobile home, and uh, so of course the lawnmower and you know the gas can are in the shed, and so are a lot of snakes and wasps, 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 wasps hornets. We'll call them hornets. And um, so I have a roof rake, and I take one of the extension poles from the roof rake, and I go out to my shed. I unlatch it pry the door open and we all got that you know three foot pole and boom any snakes don't jump out then I quickly grab the lawnmower yank it out of the shed probably have to put new shocks on that uh, lawnmower because it's been <laughs> it's been tugged quite a bit out of the shed and uh, then I get to lawnmower I try to get friends to come over to get the lawnmower out of the shed for me and they're like why I'm like, well snakes and of course the hornets and the bees and the wasps they bother my friends more than me. I got, you know, sometimes I'm out there with pole and I'm out there with a can of those, the, the raid to uh, to get the lawnmower. So once I get past that, then I'm out there mowing the lawn. And you know, frankly, I like to mow the lawn because um, I look at it this way. I look at mowing the lawn beats the heck out of having to shovel the driveway any day of the week. But you know, that's all I basically do. I don't trim the hedges, I don't weed whack, and uh, mulch is a fun word to say, but you know, what am I going to do with mulch? You know, of course, you got, the, uh, you got that one guy in the neighborhood who's out there and makes his lawn look like it belongs in one of those home and garden magazines. That kind of puts the pressure on you to uh, at least get the lawn, you know, you don't want it thigh high. <laughs> you want to keep up with it, but uh, uh, basically all I do is mow the lawn. But it is kind of funny if you're my neighbor and you see me out there getting the lawnmower out of the shed. We'll have to uh, shoot some video sometime once my lawn's ready to get mowed. But, um, you know, I have the standard gas mower. But Mr. Sunshine, you know, I'm kind of a throwback type of guy. And uh, we here uh, at the radio station recently got my ideal lawnmower. And I want to take a look and give you a, you know, come on, come go, let's go check out that lawnmower. Well, let, let's go, go to my office. I couldn't believe this when this came to the radio station. We have auctions on our website at b985.fm and uh, from Chase Toys Inc. in Unity. We're going to have some awesome landscaping items for you and I want this baby right here. Wow! I know it's extra work but I'm so old school. Look at this! I'm going to move, well, I don't want to cut the carpet up, but uh, when this goes on auction, you're going to have to outbid Mr. Sunshine, and it's going to start next Wednesday, the 22nd, beat on 85.fm, but don't bid on this because I want it. It's mine. I'm Mr. Sunshine. Have a great day.